I work at Niwa as an aquatic ecologist and the area I work in is freshwater biosecurity. Biosecurity is reducing the problems that are caused by species that aren't native to New Zealand to stop the many impacts that these things have on our environment and our utility of water. A lot of our native plants are quite low growing and these invasive species can just completely steamroller over the top of native communities. More than 80 plants are nationally threatened and if nothing is done, they are going to be extinct within the next 50 years. The problem is that once an invasive species has established and, and completely dominates an area, the opportunities you have to manage it are very limited. So the research is really looking proactively at things before they become a problem. You can look at history of what they do in similar places overseas. You can look at the characteristics of the plant, how quickly it grows, how many seeds it produces, how it spreads and how difficult it is to manage. John Clayton and I use this information to come up with a weed risk assessment model. That allows you to prioritise where your worst weeds are going to come from, but also pick the ones that you'll get the best bang for your buck as far as trying to stop them before they become a problem. We've not only done the science here, but we work closely with management agencies, Ministry for Primary Industries, Department of Conservation, Land Information New Zealand, the regional councils especially. I feel that the research is making a real difference. New Zealand is unique in the number of aquatic and wetland plants that have been eradicated from the country, so we're probably the only country in the world that have had that many successes.